Do you like that? Michael, look at me. You okay? Yeah. I'm fine. Hey, Morgan, how about, uh, how about we get in some more runs, huh? What about Michael? No, Morgan, trust me, I'm okay. Go. Have fun. Yeah, well, I'll uh, try and join you later. You've been, um, you've been remembering the night that it happened. The night I killed Claudia? You can say it. This is why I didn't want to come on the ski trip. I knew I would just lose it for whatever reason. I, I just wish I could stop thinking about it. You have a conscience, Michael. No one expects you to act like you don't. You need to let me help you. I'm not going to go talk to a shrink if that's where you're going with this. Well, you need to talk to someone, Michael. I can talk to Dad about it. You need more help than Sonny can give you. Look, I'm not... I'm not going to sit down with a doctor and spill my guts. For one thing, if I tell him the truth, he's going to tell the cops. So we find a doctor who won't tell the cops. I, I think it's a law or something. And even if... Look, if Sonny even leaned on him or Jax paid him off, it's still too much of a risk. It's a risk we need to take because I can't stand seeing you like this. I'm sorry, Mom, but you wanted me to come on this family ski trip, and all I've done is upset Morgan and remind Jax that I'm just as messed up as he thinks that I am. That is not Look, true! I need to go home. Michael, I don't want you by yourself. I can go back to Dad's. That's what I should have done in the first place. You know what? We'll all go home. We'll all just pack up and go home. No, that's not fair, especially to Morgan. Max Tillis up here. Did you see him? Yeah, I was hoping Jax wouldn't notice that. He doesn't have a problem with taking me back to poor Charles. We'll go right to Dad's. Nothing's gonna happen, I promise. seems to be immune to the cold. Gosh. He's always been like that. Oh. He's uh, taking another snowboarding lesson. Where's Michael? I let him go home. Oh, you did? Max picked him up a few minutes ago. Uh, I, I, I knew that he was trailing me. <laughs> yeah. He swore he'd go straight to Sonny's. It's the one thing I was trying to avoid. Hey, it'll all work out. You know, Michael used to be the sweetest little boy. He was kind and funny, and everyone thought it was so cute when he would imitate Sonny. He would offer people coffee and order the guards around. I never really believed that he would actually be like Sonny. Hey, you know what? Michael, Michael still has a chance at a normal life. It's just, it's up to us. But we can't make his choices for him. Yeah. I want Michael to have some peace of mind. <laughs>